today we're talking about YouTube monetization. Recently, my parents, they got monetized on their YouTube channel and they applied for their uh, verification pin. This is after hitting 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 watch hours. And Google sent this verification pin to them in the mail. Let's go through the process because there are two different services that you need to be concerned about. There's YouTube, which is where you host your videos and whatnot. And then there's another service called AdSense, which is where you see the revenue that comes in. So you have to attach this AdSense account to your YouTube account. I'm in YouTube here now in YouTube studio in my parents' account. Their name is Lance and Louise from Trinidad. If I was to go to the monetization section, because when you hit this 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 watch hours, you will notice this area here that says YouTube Partner Program. There's this publisher ID. And where does that publisher ID come from? This publisher ID comes from AdSense, that service that I mentioned a little bit earlier on. So I'm going to jump over to our next tab, which is AdSense. And you must have an AdSense account set up before so that you could link it to YouTube and collect your revenue in that one place. So I'm jumping over to AdSense. I'm just switching tabs here in my browser. This is AdSense. The same Gmail account that I would have used to create my YouTube page is the same Gmail account that I could use in AdSense. There's a section called Verification Check, and they would have gone through the process of applying for this um, PIN number, that YouTube would send to you, or AdSense in this case would send to you, and you have to enter. This is a way that um, Google is going about verifying that, okay, this person has received this mail, they have this PIN number, so it's a bit of authentication taking place. When you sign up for an AdSense account, you will get a publisher ID, and you will be able to link it in that monetization section of YouTube that I just showed you. Even though the country is listed as one thing in YouTube, in AdSense is where you will enter your mailing address. So say, for example, you live in Trinidad, you'll put your Trinidad address where you receive mail. If you live in Grenada, Jamaica, and so forth, you'll put your actual mailing details inside of AdSense so that you could receive your checks by mail. Years ago, I had a, a website, even before I started YouTube, and I'd apply to get it um monetized through AdSense. That website was down for some years and then I recently relaunched it and I have to kind of go through this process again. The name of my website is potbeak.com so if you want to find out more about my books you could go there. They have links to them on Amazon and whatnot. So you'll get to see like behind the scenes stuff and if you enjoy this type of content or Caribbean type content feel free to subscribe. So this is um, what came in the mail. This is yeah, nothing secret, so I don't have to blur this out. This would be the PIN number that they would have sent to them. And I'm going to enter that here in AdSense. And once I submit that, it tells me that my identification is verified and address verification is complete. And there you go. You could set different threshold amounts and when you get paid, whether you choose 100 US or 500 US, you receive your checks when you hit that amount. So, you know, keep making great content because it's about the views coming in and the ads that you have placed on it. If you have any questions, feel free to drop them in the comment section. And there's another video I did on YouTube on uh, monetization where I discuss the different services that are available in terms of YouTube and AdSense. So you could click on it and take care and keep creating. Hey, congrats, mom and dad. You all are amazing <laughs> to get monetized. Amazing. It take me years and I'll do it in months. Good job. Keep at it.